<clears throat> Let's try to build this structure then. And I want you guys to help me. Okay. So you guys write it down. So what's going to be, what is this going to look like? Tetrahedral, who thinks that? It's, it's going to be linear, right? Why? Because the carbons have to be bonded to each other, right? The hydrogens have to be on the outside. So there's the hydrogens. Carbon. So don't just blurt something out. If you don't know, build it, okay? So, let's build it. How many bonds are the carbons going to have between them? Two. You think? Uh, three. No, three, three. Right, three. Yeah. Okay, so let's do that. Like that. Is everybody okay with that? This this molecule that we're building is called acetylene. If you've ever used a welding torch, you've used this stuff. Okay. So, how many electron groups do you have around the this carbon atom? Electron groups. Are extensively about this last time, so all your confused looks. Why are there only two? So it just counts as one. Just like every, you know, just like a double bond, triple bond counts as one. So how many electron groups do we have around this carbon? Everybody tell me, come on. Two, two right? So what's the um, bond angle between those two bonds? Everybody tell me. 180. So what's the hybridization of that carbon? SP. SP. Very good. Okay, what's the hybridization of that carbon now? SP. SP. Very good. Any questions on that? Okay. 